Hello, in this video I'm gonna explain hearing accessibility features on iPhone 16 Pro Max. If you have hearing problems, you can set up your iPhone for, uh, uh, for this hearing problem using hearing accessibility settings. Go to settings, then go to accessibility, and then go to hearing. And in hearing, you have different options like hearing devices. And here you can co uh, connect your iPhone to your hearing aids. If your hearing aids uh, support iPhone connection. Then hearing control center. And here you can choose what will be shown in the hearing control center. Uh, when you swipe from the right top part of your screen. This is the control center and here you can add a hearing control by clicking on plus in top left corner, then add a control, then select hearing control. So I'm going to add this one here and now when I press and hold here, I see these settings which are here. Uh, then. You can go to sound recognition and when you enable it, uh, your iPhone will continuously listen to certain sounds and by using AI, it will uh, notify you when some sounds may be recognized, uh, recognized like, uh, for example, a barking dog or a doorbell ringing. Then you can go to audio and visual and here are the settings for mm, for your audio. Uh, for example, headphone accommodations. And if you have supported headphones like Apple or Beats headphones, I have AirPods Pro 2nd Gen, you can connect them to your iPhone and use headphone accommodations. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna connect my AirPods, put them in my ears. And then when I go to headphone accommodations, I can enable them. And here I can set tune audio for uh, my audiogram. If I've added one, I'm gonna show you that in a second. Balanced tone, vocal range or brightness so I can set my headphone accommodations for that. I can play a sample and I can choose whether to apply with phone, media and transparency mode. I'm gonna enable it for transparency mode and now I hear the amplification of sound uh, adjusted to my audiogram. To set an audiogram for uh, headphone accommodations, go to custom audio setup then click on continue and here you can either choose an audiogram that's in your Apple Health or um, you can add an audiogram. So click here and then uh, you can scan your uh, hearing test results with camera or add them manually and uh, in fall of 2024 hearing test on iPhone will be available so you'll be able to take a hearing test on your iPhone using AirPods Pro 2nd Gen. I'm gonna show you how to add a hearing test manually. Click on add manually then you can add from photos, from files or enter results manually. I'm gonna enter results manually then you select which frequency frequencies have symbols on your test. So you select these that are marked on your test. Then click on continue. And now you can add values uh, for uh, first for the first value. So that's gonna be for 125 Hertz. And uh, you can select at which height the cross is and the circle is, like that. Uh, 
then you add more and more And now this test is adjusted, you can click on done and now your hearing will be adjusted to this test. Click on done and now it's tuned for the audiogram I've entered. Then you can go back. Background sounds will play some sounds uh, in the background uh, to mask unwanted environmental noise. So you can enable it and choose a sound like rain or other ones. Uh, then here's Modo Audio, so it will uh, make left and right speakers play the same sound. Then voice isolation, uh, this will enhance dialogue when you're talking to someone. Power on and off sounds, uh, when you enable it you'll hear when you turn your phone on or off then headphone notifications uh, it will protect your hearing uh, by notifying you when you've been listening to loud headphones audio for long enough to affect your hearing then here is balance you can make right or left uh, audio channel louder than the other one and here is uh, a visual settings LED flash for alerts. Then you can go back. Subtitles and captioning is another option which will enable you uh, to uh, caption uh, things that you can't hear. So whenever you enable it, you'll see closed captioning on your screen. And you can adjust settings for it as well then you can go to live captions mm, and it will caption uh, things that are said on live and then the last thing is music haptics and it works in music app and in settings so when you enable it you can either play a sample or go to the music app and then select a song you want to play and if it supports a uh, music haptics then when you hold your iPhone you'll feel vibrations that will uh, imitate the songs rhythm and sounds that's all for today don't forget to like and subscribe see you next time Thank you.